What's up everybody? It's 724 on our Friday morning. This morning you get your chance to see a piece of Savannah history. Colonial Christmas is out, out at Worms Low Plantation giving you a sneak peek at life and Christmas back in the 1700s. It's Saturday and you're invited. So join me this morning to tell us all about it. Interpretive Ranger Jesse Wiest. Jesse. Hey, hi Renee. How I'm are you? I'm so glad you're here this morning. Great. I'm so glad yeah. you're dressed like that. Yeah, it's, it's so a lot of fun. fun. <laughs> Good um, thing. What are we expecting? Well, uh, Colonial Christmas is one of actually my favorite events. Um, uh, Father uh, Willoughby from St. Paul's Episcopalian uh, does a little talk where he teaches everybody about some of the differences between how Christmas was celebrated here in Savannah mm -hmm. today and back in the 1730s uh, and 40s especially. Um, a local Girl Scout troop actually comes out too. Uh, this is what makes it my favorite event is they bring cookies and apple cider. <laughs> so uh, that's pretty nice. But we'll Nobody be, can be mad about that. Yeah, um, we'll be playing uh, you know, colonial games mm -hmm. and uh, doing some Christmas carols, um, showing off the tradition of burning a Yule log. Yes. Um, Anyway, great, great Christmas tradition. And uh, I think we're going to play a game of colonial cricket as well <laughs> towards the end of the afternoon. That's what I hear, which is kind of like baseball, but just not. You just need enough people yeah, out there to play and enjoy. If you like hitting a ball with a stick, then cricket is going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> That's fantastic. Why? Why did Wormslow say, you know what, for Christmas, we need to do something just a little different? Well, I think it helps us um, explain how the people who lived here back in the past, uh, well, I like to say they weren't so different than you and I today, yeah. you know, despite the clothing. <laughs> um, but there were some differences, and I, I really help. I think that doing uh, holiday celebrations like this helps us uh, explain, you know, how these people lived yeah. and uh, how they turned a, the fledgling colony of Savannah into the, the great state of Georgia today. Well, I mean, it's literally a way for us to see our history, our ancestors. I mean, these. It could be exactly the way the people of Savannah were living. Oh yeah, no, yeah. absolutely. It's incredible. Um, yeah, we're going to bring you back to uh, you know Christmas morning, say downtown and maybe Johnson Square in I 1734. Love I love it. Yeah. It is so much fun. All right, folks, let's take a look at those details real quick. It is Saturday, December 21st. Now it starts at one o'clock. It runs until four o'clock. Going to be some wassailing, some caroling, some cricket all kinds of fun stuff, a little pyrotechnics with that uh, Absolutely. Yule log too. Oh yeah, yeah, we, we, we can't uh, go can't a day leave without out the fire. Uh, firing the muskets. Oh my goodness, and you <laughs> can't forget folks, it's it's affordable. I mean, for adults it's 10 bucks, seniors or any military active or reservists, nine bucks, kids 17 to six, 450. And you know what, kids six and under, it's only two bucks. Yeah, and actually if I can add on to that, Renee, Please. We sell family passes oh, at nice. Wormslow for $35, okay. and that actually gets you into Wormslow or any other state historic site in Georgia, and that's only $35 for a whole year. So If um, you're going to come out bargains. with four of you, yeah. might as well go ahead and grab the pass. Absolutely, yeah. Come on <laughs> back stuff. anytime and walk your dog. <laughs> I love it. Awesome. Jesse, hey. so great to have you great here this morning. You, Good Thanks. stuff. All right, everybody. It's 27 minutes after 7 on your Friday morning. Coming up, your top stories, your weather, your traffic. We'll be right back after the break.